for everyone and welcome to my DVD and Blu-ray update. Uh, well, my horror update, but I do have one that isn't horror. So I'm going to start out with the non-horror. First up, we have X-Men Apocalypse. This is the limited edition uh, Best Buy steel book. And there is the cover. And later on, I may do uh, like an unboxing for some of these individually. And there's your spine. X-Men Apocalypse. Been wanting to check this one out. And there's your list of bonus features, which there's really not that many, so there'll probably be an ultimate collection or something like that. So there's the back cover. So that is the non har which, like I said, is the still book limited edition. Uh, so that's it with that one. <laughs> so next up, we're getting into the har or har ish. Uh, and the first one up is Into the Forest with Ellen Page and Evan Rachel Wood. So there is the cover. Now this is a blind buy for me, so I don't really know that much about it. You get the Blu-ray and Digital HD, and there's your spine, and then the back. So you get the Making Into the Forest featurette, audio commentary with writer, director, Patricia Rosema and there's a closer look at the bat and there is the bat said in the near future this riveting and suspenseful apocalyptic drama follows two sisters whose peaceful lives are disrupted one day by a worldwide power outage the sisters must work together in order to survive in their increasingly treacherous new world fighting intruders, disease, loneliness, and starvation. So that sounded pretty interesting and that's why I grabbed it. Now the next one is from Korea and I've been wanting to check this out and that is The Wailing. One of the year's best films. And there's the spine. And there's the back. So bonus features you get the beginning of the whaling, making of, and trailer. Now, uh, let's see, it runs 157 minutes. Uh, it's only Korean language, but you do get the English subtitles. So if any of you have a problem with uh, watching things with subtitles, you might want to skip this. But from what I heard, this is pretty good. You know, well, I've heard mixed things, but it seems interesting enough. So that's the whaling from Korea. Uh, let's see, from acclaimed director Na Hong Jin. And then next up, I heard you know some decent stuff about this. It's almost like scanners, I guess, and it is the mind's eye. So I know nothing about this except for it's almost like scanners and you know I heard in the beginning it's a little slow but then once it picks up it gets really good. So I can't wait to check this out. This was only I believe twelve ninety nine. So there's the spine and here's the back. Which that looks pretty cool right there. And then you get a little bit of bonus features. So it looks pretty wild. Next up, I had to get it because I've seen the others and stuff like that. And yes, it's cheesy, bad, but it's also fun, bad in a way to me. And that is Sharknado, The Fourth Awakens. Oh my god. <laughs> Only at Best Buy includes exclusive bottle opener. <laughs> so yeah, you get a bottle opener. So that's pretty cool. This is the cover. And this is exclusive collector's edition. And there's your spine. And then the back. And right there is your bottle opener with the same picture as the cover. And then you get a decent amount of bonus features. Although it won't really show up too good. 
And then the next one I've been wanting to check out ever since I've seen someone do a review of this online. And that is Swiss, Swiss Army Man <laughs> with Daniel Radcliffe and Paul Dano. So this is the cover. There's the spine. And there's the back. You know, I heard that this is almost like, you know, like Daniel Radcliffe is almost like a Swiss Army knife, but it's him that's like the Swiss Army knife or some shit like that. I just wanted to check it out. Because, I mean, hell, here lately, Daniel Radcliffe's been in some really cool-ass movies. So there's the back. And there's your spine again. Now, here's the only DVD that I got. And it's called They're Watching. From the writers of Call of Duty Black Ops 2 and SpongeBob SquarePants. So I thought that was a pretty cool looking cover right there. And there's your spine. Blood and guts and pure lunacy. Special features, animal style, cellar, reveal, the frogman, strudel mania, stunt work, they're listening. So, so it seems like it'd be interesting. I just wanted to check out something that I haven't seen. So that's the bat. That's the spine. And it's from Anchor Bay. And this is the DVD, of course. Hell, I believe it was only $9.99 over at Best Buy. And the next one up, and the final thing that I picked up at Best Buy. See, I was trying to get this yesterday, but the guy there, he didn't know what the shit he was doing because he was saying, oh, you know, they might have sent it back for a recall or something like that. I went there today, and the guy that usually, you know, uh, stocks in the Blu-rays and stuff like that, he said, let me go in the back and check it out, and he got it. And that is the Young Frankenstein Limited Edition Steelbook. That shit looks sharp right there. I really like that cover. So this is the front, and like I said, you get the limited edition still book, and there's the young Frankenstein with all the characters. I like that dude that plays as Igor. And of course, you know, uh, Mel Brooks directed it, and uh, shit. I don't know why the hell I keep forgetting his name, but there's the spine, and here's the back. This is the 40th anniversary. It's basically the same thing as uh, the Blu-ray, but I miss out on getting the Blu-ray with the slip cover. So when I saw this on Blu-ray.com, I wanted to get it. And there's the list of bonus features there if you want to pause it and check it out. So that is my pickup for today for October 4th. Uh, thanks for checking my video out, and y'all have a great one. Bye.